Count me a couple more checks Get me a little more cheddar Cut me a few Gucci sweaters Roll up plenty of woods Feel good just like I should How could you have misunderstood? Have, have to do better Yo, YouTube What's good? Alright, so You remember when I was talking about all that stuff with Nordstrom and stuff returning to that that shirt. Yeah, I ain't do that in Atlanta. I'm gonna do it in Nashville today. So I'm gonna roll back the clip to explain why I'm returning this junk right, All right. now. You see this Nordstrom? This, this is the main reason I wanna go. So a couple years ago, I bought this shirt um, from Nordstrom and it's itchy as fuck, essentially. It is itchy as fuck. And, nigga, that shit was like $300. I'm not capping, I've never worn it. I try it on, I'm like, ouch, itchy, itchy, right? Um, I was looking at Nordstrom return policy on their site. They don't have like a time frame like at all. They just be like, oh, we'll work with you the best to accommodate you in the rigmarole and this and that. So, I'm gonna take y'all along to see if I can return this like four year old shirt. If I can, classic finesse, you know? All right, so now you know why. And let's get into it. We finna go and we are finna go exchange it game, game. It's just, I just get bought a pair of jeans. Nothing too serious. I'm not really liking this iPhone vlogging. No joke. Um, but I broke my camera yesterday. Dropped it and bent the lens, so gotta get a new lens. And I don't know, it's kind of a mellow day. Got me a little drink, you know, apple juice. This is soup tops with ash, you know what I'm saying? Soup tops. Mm hmm But I ain't talking about nothing for real. But yeah, that's the gist. I returned the item. It was smooth. I actually got another item I might return to. Save money, kids. Damn, this shit got as hot as fuck in the back of my throat. <laughs> Oops. But yeah, I ain't talking about nothing. I'm gonna quit boring y'all. On to the next thing we do. Yo, good morning vlog. All right, so we did that yesterday, you know, it's the next day. And all right, I got a little backstory to tell y'all. The reason why my mood was down, bro, bro, yesterday is I lost my car. So, nigga, we all, you know, I live in Memphis, right? We all the way in Nashville. I have no debit card, you feel me? So I'm just driving around out here, just lost or whatever. Well, not lost, but definitely not capable of making no purchases. Um, unless I sent it over to my Square Cash App card. But I mean, who's doing that? I need to know where my card is at, right? So... I thought I was like, all right, in Memphis, I probably just left it in a pants pocket or something or a jacket or something like that. Yeah, no, I, that wasn't the case. I came back home, looked for it, couldn't find it. Couldn't find it anywhere. And so this morning I was like, what was the last place I went before? I went to Nashville and that was Starbucks, you know? Had to be on my white girl things, had to. Uh, you know, I'm a Visco girl or whatever. I be seeing that trend out there on YouTube and stuff. I don't know what the hell they be out here wearing faded sweaters and uh, drinking sparkly purple unicorn drinks and shit. But yeah, so I lost it and I called Starbucks, right? This morning, really early. And that's where my card is. They were like, oh yeah, we're gonna da 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 and check it and they found it. 
So uh, I'm finna go get that. And then I'm gonna take these pants I bought at Nordstrom yesterday to get tailored because I couldn't pay for them without my debit card. So, you know, it's all working full spectrum this morning. Um, you know, yeah, so so let's so let's go into Starbucks real quick. Because this man is driving in front of me and he's doing pointless things. Starbucks, we're going. Bye bye. Mm. Yeah. Big Starbucks. Big bucks in the Starbucks. You already know. Oh. Okay. I guess they know who I am. Because my face is on the picture. Because she said my name. Good morning, how are you? I don't know what's going on. We're going to find out. Maybe not. Maybe she didn't know my name. Maybe I can't hear. Hey. Uh, no, I left my car here. Oh, you did? Yeah. Yeah. Waiting. Okay. Yeah, I got it. You're welcome. Ooh. Still waiting. Oh, can I get it? Can I get it? Yeah. Do you have an ID? Uh, I made my face on the picture. <laughs> yeah. First post asked for their ID. Yeah, all right. Thank I don't you. Care that much. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. So I was successful in getting my car back, you know. I'm gonna just show that. There we go. Yeah, so now let's, since I got my money back, let's go spend it. Yeah, I'm just, no, I'm serious though. Like, let's let's go spend a little bread because we gotta have these pants perfect around my ankles because that's what I get done. I get them tapered for real. So they're extra little. Like I get the, I get the stretch skinny at Top Man take them to my tailor she tapers them down even more and then they're like a perfect fit and they're a unique fit because they're custom to me and nobody has them you see what i'm saying personalize your shit sometimes i'm kind of big in this iphone vlog i remember when i was saying i hated it but nah it's kind of a vibe no cap it's, it's pretty simple easy convenient you just can't flip the camera around and shit that's the only thing i'm not messing with but everything else it's a vibe, no cap in my rap, but I ain't even rapping. Oh, dang, why are you in the road, lady? That's amazing, Memphis drivers are the worst, Pre trust me. If you come to Memphis, just be prepared to wear all your seatbelts, like two or three of them at a time, because you might get hit, no bullshit. Won't you say my name, say my name? Hey, that Summer Walker, that shit slap, nigga. Yes, sir. Let's go get these alterations done. How are you doing today? All right, you think this is what they're supposed to look like, but down here, they're gonna be looser. I mean, tighter. They're gonna be tighter down here. You'll see. Hmm? Only taper. what she did you see yeah okay yep i'm back in the whip now the only thing left i have to do today is make it to work because i am cutting it close so to work i go and i think that might also be the end of the vlog depending on how much footage i got i'm gonna have to uh piece it together and see but don't feel bad if this is the last time you see me in this video. But if it's not, and you see about this much left on there or something, that just means I needed more minutes because I ain't trying to be out here producing short videos for y'all. I'm trying to do at least 10 minute videos every time, you know what I'm saying? 
11 to 12 would be lovely, but at least 10 minutes. So y'all get a nice little and joyful watching moment of me, you know what I'm saying? Well, together, you know, us, us, going out throughout this day and week and weekends, enjoying each other's company. So let's keep going, trade troops. Let's get to a thousand subs, roll to 1K subs. It's, you know what I'm saying? It's feeling pretty close. I'm almost to 600 right now. We, I mean, we're only 400 away. And man, we didn't gain like literally since May, since May of this year, I've gained like five, 600 subscribers. I only had like 30 subscribers before May. So we've came a long way. We've definitely grown. Hopefully we hit a thousand before the year is out. That would be a lovely Christmas gift to hit a thousand subscribers before the year is out. So, you know, share this video, like, comment, subscribe, show me you enjoying it. You know what I'm saying? Don't just be liking it and subscribing just to, you know, just support. Really, really enjoy the content, watch the content. Cause I know I'll be enjoying some of y'all content and I definitely do genuinely watch. So, you know what I'm saying? Show the love back. Ashtray is out. Bang, bang, hold on. Y'all already know it's not a vlog. Unless I close it out with a hand smack on this you know, on the camera lens, you know what I'm saying? So Ash Trey is out.